Good morning, Miss Stella here from Crafts and More. Today I want to share with you what I'm going to do with this face. I'll be decorating it with duct tape. Oops, stuck together. So what I'm doing is I'm, I'm cutting the duct tape into strips. And I'm using an X-Acto knife. And you might want to use um, some kind of a cutting board or a wooden board I have here so that way you don't scratch your table. So you'll be using this to cut the strips. Measure the tape, the length depending on how, how tall your base is. Cutting these strips into one eighth to one quarter inch um, width. So you can make it wider if you want, depending on what kind of design you want to do. So I'm going to start with the pattern one. And I'll just go like that. So there's my first one there. And then I'm going to take a green one. And you know what? Make sure your base is dry and swatch this so that way uh, the tape will adhere to it. I'm going to do another one going across the pattern one in the green. And if you don't want too much excess tape, you can cut it later on the, on the bottom there. So, But you're not going to see the bottom of the face. And I'm going to go ahead and take a blue, some blue ones. Uh, I'm just going to alternate the three different colors. Go like this. I'll show you here. So like I said, you can do whatever uh, pattern you like. So, so far that's what I have. Here is the base. And I kind of just, you know, did like a, try to do the diamond um, pattern. And I kind of alternated the different duct tapes. So it doesn't have to be, you know, this way you can do stripes, you know, it could be, or squiggly lines. So I'm going to do another one and show you. Cut these off, you know, just slide your exacto knife through that and then just cut off the excess um, tape so it doesn't look sloppy. Same thing with the, um, whoop, the top there. There's some, you know, on the edge. I'm going to just cut off a little bit so it's not overlapping too far down there. But anyways... So there's that one, and I'll show you the other one I'll be decorating, and I'll be putting flowers in these. Here's something I just did. I'm not crazy about the yellow one. I don't know. It looks kind of funky. Maybe I overdid it. I'm just trying to be creative. But anyway, art is brain creative and using your imagination. So, I don't know. This has some dry plants in there. And there was a yellow one in there, so I just chose yellow. But anyways, I guess it's not that bad. <laughs> Um, if you want to, you know, revamp an old vase and give it some more depth and character, you could do this. Um, and this is another one I did that's kind of just, you know, um, different widths of the tape. So this was a pretty simple one. Anyways, I hope that you um, uh, enjoyed this idea or you liked it. I mean, you know, it's a simple if you're really bored and you want to do something um you know, productive and fun and make things pretty. But anyways, thank you so much for tuning in and thanks thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day. We'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.